Hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to Army of Ruin. I figured I might show my upgrades that I have chosen here. I've put a lot into interest for now just because the economy of the game, you can see like you need a lot. You need a lot, a lot, a lot. You can freely respec at any time, but it, they're, they're really uh, milking us here, I guess you could say uh, for that. But anyway, we have a new character to try out. Let's give him a shot. I have to complete Forge 2. I don't know how well that's going to go. New character, Kerr. Ranger bow fires a piercing shot to the right. Ooh, so that sounds kind of difficult to use. Stops moving and shoots arrows at great speed for a few seconds. Starts with plus 5% speed, minus 10% attack cooldown when moving. When not moving, minus 4% attack cooldown for every 5 levels up to 10 times. So they want us to not move as this character. How well can I use that in a stage like this? Probably not very well. Ooh, strong damage right away. But I guess that's to be assumed. So you wouldn't want to... You could move to the right. It just always shoots over in that one direction, huh? Hmm. So we're not going to have the evolution for it yet. So you'd want to... Align enemies in such a way... Hmm, it's going to be interesting to say the least. Increase the damage and the size of it. What do we want here? We want lower cooldown, more projectiles. We could try Energy Bolt. Uh, probably. With this. This is going to be tough because, I mean, the last stage the game claimed was my toughest, but this is probably harder because this stage just in general is quite a bit harder, I think. Hey, okay. does energy ball just shoot where I am? So this is this would be a great character for an AFK build, uh, but you wouldn't really want toxic stench. You want something that has a cooldown, kind of right? Because of the minus up to minus forty percent cooldown if you stand still. Yeah, so I guess you wouldn't want toxic stench. These actually do not seem great. I'm actually kind of considering re-rolling. Or I could just do the bolt. Why don't we just do the bolt? Does the bolt just go where I'm pointing? Oh. I actually did not know that. I don't know if I love that. And I wonder... When does it actually start calculating the minus cooldown versus the plus? I think we just want this either way. It's not currently part of the evolutions, but it will be. I think we do do that. Let's see, what do we got here for items? Let's see what the skill looks like. Oh, okay, so I stand still and become a turret for a little while. It's actually pretty good. That should be really good versus the boss is, I'd imagine. Just boots. Okay, Seal of Purity. I've never seen this one. Plus 5% damage out to boss and elites. Upon defeating them, recover 10% of your health and advance your skill cooldown by 10%. Um, I mean, it's okay. <laughs> it actually doesn't seem that great, really. I think I'm just going to go with this for now. Well, I want to see what weapons we get first, probably. Uh, before I make that kind of decision. Got a rose here. Gonna be a little while on this skill cooldown. You can use the environment to potentially create a kind of bottleneck where maybe enemies only come from the right. I don't know if you could fully do that, but maybe. Maybe not so much in this stage, but I feel, it does feel like in some stages you can do that. Okay, there we go. Looks good. Grab this chest. Drink it up. Very good. Hmm. Silver bullets could be interesting for this. I don't necessarily need wind. You can't really take frozen cross. We'll probably need wind. This is a new one for us. Projectile speed and knockback seems like it would work. Okay. Seems like it should work for us. Wind and night. Okay. 
The heart's also interesting. Let's go dagger because it kind of suits us. All projectiles kind of thing, right? I think this could make sense. All right, now let's head, make our way toward the chest. What other projectiles are there? Hmm. The spears, I don't know if they count. Orbs probably count? Should count. Hmm. I do like the orbs. This one's pretty good too, I gotta say. I think this one's pretty decent. Hmm. It's tough. Kind of almost feel like rolling this. Uh. Oops, kind of count, but only kind of. <laughs> Hmm. I don't know. I don't know why, but I want to see what else we got. Double green for the wolf's fang. Yeah, I don't know about the necromancer gauntlets. Double green for the wolf's fang sounds like it'd be tough. It's gonna have to wait for another day, I think. Okay, let's grab this chest for now. Maybe the spears would be good, just because we're all, we already have two weapons that require us to think about our our facing here with the energy bowl and the daggers so maybe that would make sense Ooh, nice a triple i like i like okay use our skill a bit here i wonder if duration affects the skill you wouldn't think so magnifier no Let's get the web start getting the weapon up. I need something for that has the knight element here. Let the boss go. Okay, so just constantly walking to the left could probably work as this character. Arrows shoot behind you, or maybe just to the right even. Why do you need to shoot behind you if we're always walking in the other direction? Yeah. Okay. I guess this is actually what you'd want. Let's see. This has light on it. Crawling root. That is actually a projectile and it makes sense. But if I take that... No, okay, so we need a grass and a knight if I take that. Okay, so that can work. Yeah, that works with us. It's a projectile and everything. Uh, I'm gonna wait a second on this skill, but wait for this thing to charge at me. Just to make sure. I think I'm missing here. <laughs> I think I hit that wall a bunch of times. I tried, though. Come on. Get that damage in. There we go. Still quite a ways away here. Silver bullets. Plus 100% knockback. Could be interesting. Not everything seems to knock back though. Yeah, I don't really know. Well, the throwing axe. Now the throwing axe we can't fit the evolution for. Would we want to consider it anyway? I don't love it. I need, um... Night and grass for our trinkets. Let's hold out on our last weapon for now. So I guess I'll just take Ranger Bow. I don't really want to roll there. It could only it's possible it would just get worse, really. Alrighty. Ooh, a bomb. Nice. Okay. Maybe we'll just hang out here for a while. Is it possible to just aim without actually moving here? Doesn't really look it. Which is too bad. Hmm. Trying to get that minus cooldown by standing still a lot. I know things are getting a little dicey. Boss is here. Uh oh. Perhaps dicier than I should have allowed. 
Okay, okay, okay. We'll be fine. Oh, that pump's like really far away now. Come on. All right. It just makes it all the more juicier. Excuse me, friends. Very good. Oh, crap. <laughs> all right, so we can... We will be able to evolve the orb if I take it. So I guess I should just take it, really. Now, this does have the night element. But it's really... Bad. <laughs> like, really bad, I feel. Let's just take the orbs for now. Oh, I did not see that boss there. That was rough. Excuse me. Hit a boss a bunch of times here. It's going to be a long time before we can evolve anything still. Why don't we just take this? One on the orb. We got a flower too, apparently. Okay, any arrows around our screen? Don't see any, alright. I guess I'll just kinda hang out here, collect some XP. Tax size for the green. <gasps> Wait! When did I get that magic mirror, the ice mirror? Are we seeing that? Can my mouse tell me? When did I get that? Crap, now we got double ice. Was that a glitch? I don't know. That's really weird, right? I guess we're gonna try to evolve the... Now I don't know what to do. Was that, did I get a level and I wasn't paying attention? I'm gonna have to watch that back. I don't know, I, th I don't know. I don't know what happened. All right, well, anyway, let's focus. I can either take the magnifier and I can evolve the roots in the orb, or I can hold out for something that has nighttime on, it has the night element. And we can evolve the energy bolt and or the daggers. I guess I'll try to hold out. So I'll just level up the root. I could roll. I have one more roll. I'm going to try to wait, though. It's really strange. I'd, I'm going to have to watch it back. I'm not going to be able to tell you in the video how it happened here, really. But feel free to let me know how it happened when it got picked up. Did I misclick on a level, maybe? That's probably the most likely scenario. I thought I picked one thing, but I ac accidentally picked that ice mirror or something like that. That's probably what actually happened. Well, crud. Okay. So that's the ice mirror uh, in action there. Ooh, another bomb. That's ice again, so we don't really don't want that. We don't want these really any of them. Please don't screw me. Almost got screwed. Not quite though. All right, I guess we're taking the Raven's Wing. Twenty-five percent less XP though, but at least we got quite a few levels before we had to take it. So that's something. God, without pickup range, like not moving at all is really difficult. I really wish I could aim. Can I aim with my mouse? No. Not really. I wish I could aim without moving. Excuse me, Goose. I want to save the cooldown for when I actually see a boss, I think. Excuse me. There's a boss. Okay. Am I just firing wildly? Was I actually aiming that? I'm not sure, really. All right, so energy bolt and spectral dagger is what we're evolving. Okay, I should probably just grab the bomb right about now. Oh yeah. Uh, try to sneak through here. Excuse me, my friends. The chicken right there, at least. Mike. 
All right, and now? Look at all the goos, oh my god. Ah, uh, the Raven Wing is gonna be probably the most potent thing. It's just plus 25% flat, uh, not flat damage, but across the board. Plus 25% damage across the board is very useful right now, I think we can say. Okay, that was good. Oh, excuse me. Still quite a bit of ways from an evolution here. Let's get the energy bolt up. Okay. Daggers up. That's good. And there's an item to our bottom right over here. So let's head that way. It's really hard to not move and actually make use of this character's skill. But it is interesting, I'll give them. Right? I have to, like, constantly adjust to aim at the enemies that are closest to us. It's the problem. But maybe there's ways to utilize it still. Okay. Ooh, that'll be nice, actually. It's probably about time we got something like that. All right, the... Hmm. Out of rolls. Took the coin purse, huh? I don't remember doing that. <laughs> Let's see. What's the best here, I wonder? Well, in case I die, why don't we just get the ranger bow up to max level? Freeze enemies every 25 seconds. More knockback? Let's fill that out, I'm thinking. Definitely the Raven's Wing. I don't see any bosses for my cooldown, but they are surrounding. Wait a bit. Why don't we just fire away into the crowds a bit here? Alright, looks good. Okay. Hmm. Uh-oh. Probably the wing again here. Or, no, let's get energy bolt to five. And we'll try to get that evolution. And hopefully some miracles will happen here. I mean, it might not look that bad right now, I guess. In fact, we only got a handful of minutes left, surprisingly. So I guess we're actually doing okay. Kind of shocked, really. Uh-oh. Ability's up, though. So let's start firing. Dang, that ability feels very strong, I gotta say. All right, let's check out what's up here. Let's see. Ooh, 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 ooh. I don't know why I decided to let that happen. Oh, there's a boss. Okay, watch out. Oh, it's a piggy bank? Okay. That's probably good because we do actually get a damage bonus after picking up money. There's two bosses on screen apparently now. Okay. Looking good. Very nice, very nice. I like it. And we got the energy bolt evolution. Extremely fast and powerful projectile. Oh, so it's more like a laser beam now, it looks. Probably just the bracer. I feel like we could get a win here, surprisingly. Which is strange, because I actually attempted this level with another character. And it felt extremely difficult, but this is actually doing really well. Okay. Alright, I'm aiming right at the boss, it looks, right now. So, energy bolt doing some work for us here. It's got the bracer just maxed now. Very good. Uh, it's gonna be a while before we can evolve anything. Might just want to pick this up, honestly. Yeah, we kind of got to run. 
Getting surrounded right now. Ooh, very good though. Good pickups, I'd say there. Okay. So if I just move like a tiny bit at a time, it looks like we keep the buff for the most part. Oh man, one of those suck orbs would be so useful right now, wouldn't it? There's an item in the top right. Let me try to grab some XP first though. Look at it all, huh? It's crazy. Let's just get the ranger bow up there. Okay, excuse me. Let us see. All right, so we could get another chest. So yeah, let's just grab the dagger now. The evolved dagger just lets them bounce all over the place. That should be useful. I don't know. I wonder how limited the bounces are. I wonder if projectile speed does more than it lets on like in some of the other games where it increases the projectile lifespan too. It's just boots here, unfortunately. <laughs> Not much of a pickup. We got a boss here. Why don't we try to kill it? Yeah, we have a lot of damage, it feels. All right. Spectral daggers have now been evolved. Should be quite good. How quickly can we kill something like this summoning thing? Pretty fast, considering, I gotta say. I think in the upgrade tree, you actually don't want to take minus cooldown that much because there's so many weapons that act, don't wind up using a cooldown. Maybe not so many, but some some don't. Toxic stench, evolved volcanic orbs. Hmm, maybe one other thing if, that I can't remember. I don't know. It feels like you might as well go for damage at that point more so. You get 5% per level. I guess at the end of the day, the price increases so much. You still kind of got to even it out to some degree. All right, there we go. Let's just get the evolution for that now, I think. So now at least that'll get unlocked even if we lose. We only got 30 seconds here. An item for us over here. I don't see any bosses to fire away at. I haven't seen a tome to for the cooldown reduction in a long time. Okay, that's a bomb. That'll be nice. Question is, do I use it now? The boss is about to spawn. You know what? Let's use it now. Get the kills. And this way we have some XP to grab around us, I guess. Because it takes a little while. Ooh, standing still here could be kind of dangerous. Still gonna go for it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ugh! <laughs> well, we got it down to half with one cooldown. Oh, crap. Watch out for those razors, huh? What hit me there? Oh, the flame trap. It's hard to just stand still on this boss. Good challenge, though. Oops, sorry. Let's see. What would be the most important here? Maybe the coin purse. Oh, come on. It shot right through that thing. Oh, I guess it shoots through walls with that. That's not great for us. We're kind of just waiting for the cooldown before we target the boss again. But it's actually losing health pretty fast. Okay, not yet. Let's dodge the next one and then go. Go, 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 go. There it is. Hey, easy win. Wow, this character is really powerful, I gotta say. Surprisingly so. I thought we were going to have a rough time here. And we got a bunch of uh, new upgrades, it looks. Homemade explosives is the new weapon unlocked. We got some bunch of money. Ranger bow evolution should be here. Oh, right. Now we can also just see the bow everywhere, it looks. So how was the DPS? The ranger bow, surprisingly not that bad. Spectral Needle wound up doing better, but we didn't evolve it till the last couple of minutes. So it's kind of hard to say, actually. 
but the regular spectral dagger was actually doing pretty decent for a regular weapon so maybe that was just pretty good overall i gotta say hmm interesting so yeah i mean i guess the spectral needle is actually just pretty decent out of at least what we had didn't have much this run honestly but god it's uh the game's definitely gotten very good there's a lot more for me to still see got 4k gold to spend thank you all so much for watching like comment subscribe and i'll check you all out in the next video all right bye everyone